So Ocelot has some Slay the Spire character icon patches, and uh, I love Slay the Spire, so I'm going to print these, and I'm going to test out doing a color change on the Neptune 4 Pro. And the first patch is uh, on the slicer, as you can hear, if possibly, the, the fan on the Neptune just kicked in. But uh, yeah, just clicking that button, and it uh, went off to the printer. And hopefully it'll let me do a color change. And unfortunately, the first test, uh, it did not work. It just finished printing, so that's unfortunate. And unfortunately, test two failed. I changed the uh, G-code flavor to uh, Clipper, and it did not seem to uh, help. It just made it run slower. So I'll try and figure this out. And I got it to work. Uh, so let's let me get this uh, filament change real quick. Now to do it on 3D Maker Noob's uh, YouTube channel, there's a video called Clipper and M600 Color Change Macro. Um, it links to the uh, GitHub, but you copy this. And then in Clipper, you have to go to your printer config and uh, paste it in. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Yeah, I just pasted it into the config and it worked. And now my Neptune 4 Pro can do color changes, so this is awesome. Time to get the rest of these printed now.